What's going on guys? Today I will be taking you through a couple of tips and tricks for beginners starting off in Ghost Simulator. Now I wrote these as tips and tricks for beginners, but really it's kind of useful for most people, uh, no matter where they are in the game, because a lot of it is based on keeping up with the current uh, state, so to speak. Now let's start off with the first one, codes. I haven't come out with any code videos, but I will start coming out with code update videos, stuff like that, uh, every so often, and because the codes change every week, and not every week, every other week, and sometimes, you know, a code that worked doesn't work anymore, so you, if you want to keep up to date on codes, then um, subscribe to the channel, but anyways, uh, codes are really good. In fact, I have a code pet in my team right now. Let's see, where is it? Sunset Pegasus. Really good pet. And it was a code pet. And that's what they do. They create code pets so that you can keep up to date on the current power in the game. Because, like, let's say something like, um, let's see, what was the previous? I don't have any, like, previous godlies. Maybe debug. So this is... Uh, level 10 okay it's a level 10 <laughs> and um, it was a purchasable godly I got it from winning a competition but uh, it's purchasable godly and at level 10 it's only 58.76 times for the speed of the vac and then uh, times 23 ecto tokens uh, while the code pet has times 120 to the speed and times 48 for the ecto tokens. So again, codes, so useful, so, almost completely necessary. Like, I mean, if you spend hours and hours getting uh, different pets in this game, like stuff that you can unlock, like maybe the Rebirth pet that I have that's super, super OP. Um, or you get like Bumbly from the new event. You know, like if you get pets like this, big cheese and stuff, you shouldn't have too much trouble without the code pets. But again, I have a code pet on my team and I still have like other really good pets. Which reminds me, I'm probably going to give away these skellies someday, so you don't want to miss that, so subscribe to the channel. Let's see. Anyways, uh, so yeah, codes. Very, very nice. Very, very necessary. Uh, the second is actually limited time events. Because let's go to the metaverse real quick. Completing quest lines and like events like this and also and stuff like that. They give you really good pets as well, like, let's see, let's go to inventory, pets, I had, Apple Froth was from the Halloween event, and as you can see, it's very, very good, uh, which, was this the one, no, this wasn't the one for the newest Easter event, this was for last year, Easter event, and, um, times 90, so very very good ringer was for christmas last year and present stack was for christmas this year anyways i i, I forgot which pet i got from this one. Oh, it's bumbly and bumbly is like as good if not even better than sunset pegasus because no nope, it's the same so Bumbly and Sunset Pegasus, and you can get Bumbly just from completing this simple little quest line here that you can do at any level. I've seen beginners do it, I've seen experts do it, it doesn't matter where you're at, 
you can still get this amazing, amazing pet. So always keep on top of the limited time events. Usually the quest lines won't take too much grinding. The Christmas one is probably the most grindy of the quest lines because you got to defeat, uh, or you got to do quest lines for like four elves, and then you can face the boss, and then you get the um, the pet, and like. In, in events, you can also grind for uh, crystals to buy uh, stuff in the shop, like pet crates, or cool hoverboards. So yeah, limited time events, very, very useful. Another useful tip, complete the main quest lines. It's so easy to do, and while you're completing them, you're earning gems, and you're also gaining the materials necessary to upgrade your antenna or unlock new areas it's very look i i even i rebirthed not too long ago uh yesterday actually and i'm working on captain finsley's quest line and uh and i always i always have the main quest line up because i can work on it if i'm like in an area and i also accept side quests so that I, if i'm ever in that or area or if i ever have anything to do with that i can kill two birds with one stone metaphorically speaking um or literally when you're talking about parrots i'm sorry yeah so right now i've been in a level 10 and that's because as i completed the quest i would just continuously get materials and that's that's the way to go really and side quests also give you gems but here's the thing the if you do the codes and the limited time events it's not much use you you can't get much use from the pets in these crates because if i'm right the godly in the last crate only does like times eight and then times four for the other stat um, so it's not nearly as good as the code pet, the limited time event pet. The final tip is subscribing to my channel because I will see if maybe I can do some giveaways of, uh, like, let's say if I give away some of my cosmics or some of my skellies, they're not... The Skelly isn't that good in stats, nor is the Cosmic, but the Skelly you can trade to more experienced players because this is a limited time event from a long time ago. And I got lucky. I got four Skellies. I traded one away, which I shouldn't have done. But I, I may also consider giving away some digits, some of this. Uh, also, you'll get brilliant content from me. Uh, about codes and about other tips and tricks or other quest lines and how to do certain stuff and I also read comments so if you comment down below what you want me to make a video on in relation to this game then there is a 90% chance unless this video fails horribly that I will make a video on what you want me to make a video on about this game but other than that guys thanks for joining us today I had a lot of fun making this video, and hopefully I'll be able to make more Ghost Simulator videos in the future. But other than that, that'll be all. <laughs> Have a nice day, and I'll see you guys next video.